What's the Chow Ching Chow? Slancer Joe here, and welcome to Pokemon Scythe. A brand new, well, I say brand new, it's actually kind of, it's, it's a new game that we haven't played before. And of course, welcome to the Trial Run, a series on my channel where we play through ROM hacks and uh, fan-made RPG Maker games for the first time blind. In order to see what they're like and to have a little bit of a fun experience and to show them off. This is Pokemon Scythe. The link to the commu Pokemon community thread about this game is down in the description below. Go and check it out and let them uh, let their ROM hack creator know that I'm recording, uh, that I'm making a series for them. Because I'm not allowed to advertise over there. So please do it on my behalf. Because I can't do it. I'm not allowed to. It says no self-advertising on the focal... It's like one of the rules. But, you know, if you guys can advertise for me or let somehow let the ROM hack creator know that I'm playing their game, that would be awesome. So, cannot wait to play this. Really excited about this one. It's got Darkrai on it. Darkrai's my fav... Uh, Darkrai's my favourite mythical. So, it can't be that bad. In fact, you know what? Give me a sec. Here's my own dark eye. So it's got to be a good game because I have my own dark eye. And he can join me for this LP. So, without further ado... That was a bit creepy. You know, that sound pop was very creepy. I don't like that. Okay, you're explaining the various buttons. This is a ROM hack of Fire Red, by the way. And this is a full, complete version of a ROM hack of Fire Red. It's got eight gyms, uh, starters, and everything. It's really cool. It's, I think it's even got Megas, so... Should be really good. Uh, it's, um, cannot wait to play this. I will leave all the links down in the description below to all the people who are uh, part of this pro uh, who uh, made this game. Before you start, I want to clarify that this is a non-profit fan-made game. If you are paid for this in any way, shape or form, you probably got scammed. It is also important that the game has huge spoilers for a Pokemon game from 2008 on the DS. Pokemon Shadows of Olmia. Oh, Pokemon Ranger 2. That's a game I really wanted to play on the channel, but I need to get hold of Pokemon 1. I need to get hold of the, uh, the entire trio because I really want to play those on the channel. And uh, the emulated copies of them are not the best, and they require use of the touchscreen a lot in order to play them. Same with things like Pokemon Dash, a game, another another game I want to play on the channel one day. But again, requires a lot of use of the touchscreen, and would probably be better played on my actual capture card than on a emulator. I recommend playing that game. I. Uh, to have uh, an enhanced experience. I played Guardian Signs and I played a bit of Pokemon Ranger, but I have not played Shadows of Armia. I might need to play that sometime. Let me know if you'd like to see a Pokemon Ranger uh, uh, series on the channel, but I would like to bring it to you guys if I can get hold of an actual copy of the games, because they're very expensive, other games. Uh, especially if you want to try and find one with, uh, without the mana fee egg being uh, used, because the yeah, mana fee egg is like one per card, and if you change, if the user changed cards and activated the mana fee event, you couldn't activate the mana fee event again. Through your adventure, uh, through your adventure, we hope that you interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. 
That is the biggest objective. That's a that's part that's what the trial run is all about. Of course, I'm going to talk to everyone. That's what I do in the trial run. I want to show off everything. That's how the trial one works. When you're ready, press A to begin your adventure. I'm ready now. Hey, Professor Sycamore. Oh, uh, bonjour. Um, uh, hello there. Um, welcome to the uh, world of Pokemon. Uh, my name is uh, uh, Professor Whittles. I am uh, and the and I am the Pokemon Professor of the Coin Region. What is Cohen, you say? Cohen is a region that is very close to Hoenn, it is, and it is a place of modern culture. Just like many other regions, Cohen is also inhabited by a Pokemon. They appear in the seas, in the skies, and everywhere about the place. Pokemon are uh, my profession, and I study, research, and observe them. For some people, Pokemon are pets, and other people use them for the battling. For myself, I study Pokemon as a profession, as I have already said. Were you not listening? I was listening, don't worry, Professor. It's, uh, you don't need to put it on a test. I was listening, and so was Dot. And so was Darkrai. Now, please, would you tell me a little about yourself? Are you a boy or a girl? I am a boy, and in the trial runs, I like to play as a boy. Uh, in my Nuzlocke series, I like to play as a girl named Joanne, but in my trial run series, I like to play as a boy named Joe. Let's begin with your name. What is it, uh, my name um my joypad is not working the best let me try let me uh fix this again please right up down left no 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 uh left right oh that's why i had right setters down Okay, now it's working better. Down, uh, right was all, wasn't was just right, it was also down. Uh, so it was all over the place. Right, so your name is Joe? Yes, my name is Joe. Joe, your very own Pokemon legends about to unfold. A world where dreams and adventure with Pokemon awaits. Let's go! Joe, the sun's already up. Can you uh, come down? And I have to talk to you about something. Alright, I'll come down. Uh, uh, ignore the... Uh, uh, the I'm going to put text speed on fast. Uh, set to stereo. And go with that screen. Ignore the bottom of the screen. It's a bit of a bug. Uh, a lot of GBA ROM hacks have this. Okay? It, ju it just a lot of GBA ROM hacks have this. Uh, bottom of the screen. So, uh, so, uh, so when I go to the pause button... Uh, like, when I go to the pause screen, please ignore this. It's going to be like this with a lot of GBA ROM hacks. It's it's a bug. They can't sometimes fix that. It's my computer. It's time to go. It's a Wii! I guess it won't be that great without the Wii Shop. Rest in peace, Wii Shop. Rest in peace, Wii Shop. Uh, there is a show... On uh, with a there is a show on with a girl in a bunny costume. Nobody get furries. It's a comfy bed, but this is not the time to sleep. Okay, um, sit down, honey. Okay. You see, 
It's been 10 years since the accident happened. What accident? They said that it, we it will be able to move back after five years. However, they pushed it back and stayed silent about it uh, in the recent years. I think we can't go back. But hey! Isn't this a region, a great region too? I'm loving living here. And we are living pretty comfortably now too. We, uh, we, uh, break, uh, we have some breaking news. Uh, this is brought to you by Sky News. We've got some news coming in. Welcome to the, today's most important Colin news. Please. Today I have actually have a few things to report about the Hoenn region. The Marwal accident has already uh, has already happened about ten years ago. As we know, as everyone knows. Why do you need to put that? We all know the situation. As everyone knows, is a horrible thing to say. Because if everybody knows it, why are we stating it? Anyway, as ev as everyone knows, the old Marvel has been revamped into a nuclear power plant. Everything was going fine until it suddenly exploded without any signs of malfunction. This engulfed, uh, this endangered uh, the entirety of West Hoenn and roughly half of the region had been evacuated. Life for humans won't be possible there for decades due to the radiation. We're not playing uranium again, are we? I thought we got that behind me. I thought I, ne I said I never wanted to play uranium again. <laughs> However, wildlife, including Pokemon, have been able to populate uh, the area by now. The, ca uh, the cause has it remained unknown until now. Authorities have found out that the explosion might have been caused by an explosive. Okay. The main reactor was the victim of a terrorist attack, but the defaces are still unknown. Next up, we have the weather. Forecast by Sky News. This has been Sky News. Do, 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 do. Wait, that's ITN. <laughs> Sorry, wrong sky, wrong theme. <laughs> if I did the right theme, they'd probably get, they'd probably uh, copyright this video. Though. An explosive. But who could have done such a thing? And it won't be safe there for decades. I guess I was right. Hope uh, it'll be okay like this, but it's already been 10 years, right? Who could that be? Five minutes later. It takes you five minutes to answer the door? Maybe they do just small talks. Maybe there's uh, maybe just a lot of small talk. You won't believe this, but Professor Whittles the Pokemon professor has sent you a letter. It takes you five minutes to check the letter? Maybe again she was talking, uh, you know, do small talk with the postman. Dear Joe. Wait, no. I should be doing his voice. Uh, dear Joe, I have just heard that you have turned 15, which means you are legally allowed to have a Pokemon. I thought I would have to be 10, not 15. I'm 15 now. That makes no sense. Why am I allowed to only have a Pokemon at 15? I thought it was 10. Okay, maybe it changes for regions. 
I would like to uh, ask you to do something. Uh, so would you uh, look uh, for me in the Pokemon Lab in the Brandon Town, uh, Biden Town? You need to head east after you step out of your house. I hope you uh, find it by yourself. Sincerely, Professor Whittles. Uh, Oh wow, this is great news, Joe. I think you should get uh, to the professor as soon as you can. Good luck, honey. All right. There's a show on the TV. Looks like Mum is enjoying it. Okay. It is full of all kinds of books and some Asian comic. Uh. Okay. It is full of delicious food, though I'm not hungry. Oh, but I am. It's lunchtime. It actually is lunchtime when I'm recording this. But I'll have lunch after this video. Bren Biden Town. A place of new beginnings. I live in Biden Town. I don't have to go that far. I'm sometimes amazed by people who manage to change their destiny from um, their own future. It's so inspiring to me. Okay. There are many kinds of people, so be ready to meet a lot of them. Okay. I am ready to meet lots and, diff uh, lots, and lots of people. I don't have running shoes. I should probably help the professor first. Okay, I will help the professor. Can I go down here? There's literally nothing here. It's a field of flowers. Okay, but I can go down there. What is up here? Nothing. I see nothing so far. It's a nice scenic route. I can go to Route 10, but I need cut. I do not have cut. I cannot go to Route 10. Route 10. The power of science is amazing. You can remake DS games on the GBA. My favorite is Pokemon R Black Redux. Though it's still a work in progress. Okay, I might have to look that up. I mean, I'm always interested in uh, uh, D-makes. They're always really cool. I should probably help the professors first. Whittle's Pokemon Lab. Okay. Uh, bonjour. Hello there, Joe. I see you got my letter. Well, I won't uh, waste your time and uh, get to the point. I need your help. I need you to get a very special berry for me from the small forest to the south of uh, Bryden Town. It is a your, it is a small yellow belly, uh, and it is hard to uh, not identify it immediately. Oh, and uh, don't worry, the forest doesn't have many dangerous uh, wild Pokémon, so don't worry. I am counting on you, Joe. Uh, and oh, if you find it, could you bring it uh, up? Uh, to the next floor for me. Okay, but if there's no dangerous Pokemon, how come you can't do this mission, Professor Whittles? Pokemon show up in many shapes and types. You know that, right? Yeah, I know that. I'm running some tests about uh, the uh, DNA of a Pokemon with Ruckus. It's a rare virus that causes Pokemon to grow... Wait, Pokerus, you mean? Yeah, Pokerus. <laughs> I thought I, I said Ruckus. <laughs> but no, it's Pokerus. It's Pokerus. <laughs> it's a rare virus that causes Pokemon to grow and develop faster. Okay. I probably should go and get what Professor Whittle needs first. Alright, fine. I'll go and get it. What's this? 
I can't talk to it. There are all kinds of studies about Pokemon on this laptop. Okay. I guess we're going into the forest. Petter Forest. Interesting. I mean, I like the Dream Yard music. I mean, I've always loved the music from Pokemon Black and White. I found one speck Salak berry. I put it in my key items pocket. This must be the berry the professor mentioned. That was easy. Like there's a septile. Septile, return. I should probably get back to the professor as fast as I can. Okie dokie. I mean, I have no running shoes, so I'll go as I'll go walking speed. But the septile was interesting. Oh, uh, uh, you are back. Great. Uh, uh, how did it go? Uh, what? A, a septile, uh, uh, and it wanted to attack you? If you uh, had... If I had known about this and it, it was going to happen, uh, I would have uh, gone there myself. I have Pokemon, so I would have been fine. Sorry for putting you through such a dangerous situation. So to make up for it, uh, and because you actually got, uh, found the berry, I will give you your own Pokemon. These Pokeballs uh, contain Pokemon. That will accompany you on your uh, journey. Pick it wisely, Joe. Because I am only giving you one of these Pokemon. They are extremely rare. Okay, Doki. So it's time to see what our starters are for this game. Uh, the TV is on National Poke. There's a documentary going on about Pokemon breeding. Okay. It's some sort of machine. Better not touch it. Okay. There are all kinds of uh, books about science and Pokemon. There are all kinds of books about science and Pokemon. Hey, uh, where are you going, Joe? Aren't you going to pick a Pokemon? Alright, fine, I'll pick a Pokemon. I like to discover everything, including walk-away text, just in case. So we got Turchwig. We got Oshawott. And we got Fennekin. Okay, I like all three of these Pokemon. I like Oshawott's really nice. I mean, I had an Osh... I had an Ash Oshawa in Black 2 named Samuel, I think I did. I've had an Oshawa before named Samuel before. I've had a Delphox. I I, I, I mean, Delphox is my... Uh, Fennec is my favourite uh, of the Sipgen starters. Uh, you know, a lot of people like Greninja. I like Fennekin. I like Delphox. Don't hate me. But Torterra is really cool. I love Torterra. And this is an interest. This is an interesting uh, free to pick. Um, I'm gonna go with Torterra. This Pokeball contains Turchwig. Would you like to take the Tweety Twig Pokemon? Turchwig. Yes, I would. Joe obtained Turchwig. Uh, before you ask, I wanted to give you a Pokemon anyways. Uh, I wanted to see how reliable as a trainer you are anyway. Now that uh, you have your own Pokemon, I will give you a few things you'll uh, definitely be needing on this journey. Pokeballs, the lock starts now. No, no kidding, this is not a Nuzlocke. <laughs> a potion, thank you. Oh, and uh, before I forget... A Pokédex! This is a Pokédex. It is a high-tech encyclopedia that records uh, data about uh, 
Pokemon. If you catch a Pokemon, it uh, records uh, more data, like habitats and all that. If you want to complete the Pokedex while you are on a journey, you can. This is uh, what I originally wanted to ask you to do, but uh, you don't have to do it. Uh, now that you are completely set up, let's go and become the very best that you can be. Like no one ever was. Alright. I will be the very best. Like no one ever was. To catch them is my... No, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. I'll get copyright claims if I continue on. <laughs> okay, so... I can't go that way because I need cut. So I guess I'm going this way past my mum's house. But before we do that, let's take a look at Turchwig. Serious Nature met at Brand uh, Biden Town at level 5. Okay, as it stats. It has Tackle and Withdraw. Okay. Very, very interesting. So I guess we're going... This way? Joe, since you're setting off on an adventure, uh, I wanted to say uh, good luck and take these with you. Running shoes! Thanks, Mum! I got my new kicks! Uh, I hope you'll have a great journey and become uh, the person you always wanted to be. Alright, cool. I have running shoes and I run pretty fast in this game. Okay, route one. Hello. Nature uh, is so calm and beautiful. It is. What can we find in the grass? We can find a Bidoof. I do not want a Bidoof, but I do like the battle graphics. I really do. Battle Forest. And the music's pretty nice too. Starly's also here. Tackle. Another one, please. Okay. Uh, what do you have to say for me? Wild Pokemon might jump out of the tall grass, so be careful whenever you walk around it. Alright. Sometimes I like to press the speed up button, I will admit. Sometimes I like to press the speed up button, especially when we're in endless wild battles. And we're trying to try. Oh! I love bugs! Okay. We're playing the book. Uh, we're playing our first trainer. That's a waddle level 3. I can handle this, I think. Ow, that was a crit. Maybe I can't. Okay, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I don't like crits. I really don't like crits. If there's anything you guys should know about me, it's I don't like crits. Does my mum heal me? Hi honey. Your Pokemon look tired. Let me heal them up for you. Thank you mum. Great. They're, they are ready to go on battle. They're going battle again. Keep going honey. Thanks mum. I will. Okay, so let's continue on through the Petal Forest. Uh, 
There's a... Is that a cut bush? I have no idea whether that's a cut bush or not. Either way, I can't go that way. Let's battle you. You are Burmy. Oh, really? Are we really doing this? Are we really facing a Burmy with Protect? Uh, you know what? I'm glad I'm using the speed up button on this. I hate Burmies. I really do. Burmies with Protect is really annoying. I don't mind Motham or Wormadam, but like Burmy just constantly spamming Protect is really annoying. Okay. What can I find in the grass here? In the forest. I like the fact the routes are short. Okay, there's Pikachu. And there actually is a Burmy. Yeah, I'm not catching that. There's some Waddle, but I already have a grass type, so I'm not interested in that either. Uh, so I won't be catching that. Anything else? Cheroby? But again, don't really need that because I already have a grass type. Okay, so there's not really that much in the grass that I actually want to catch. Route 1. Uh, this is uh, this is also Route 1. This is, I guess, Route uh, 1 North. There's Starly. Uh, let's go up here. This is Craden City. Welcome to today's news on the Cola News Network, brought to you by Sky News. Today we have a great announcement that will uh, definitely get every trainer's attention. The Cola Pokemon League has opened its doors, so, and so did the... Uh, Pokemon League Challenge. That means that trainers around Cohen can participate by getting as, as many of the eight badges as they can. When they manage to collect them all, they can enter the Pokemon League to become the region's very first champion. I am here with a young trainer that just started their Pokemon journey. Now, uh, tell me, are you ready to... Uh, are you planning on joining the challenge? Am I? Uh, actually, I was on my way to the Pokemon Gym to attempt to get in my first gym badge when you caught me. Me and my Rattata uh, will become the top, uh, uh, top of the tops. That's the spirit. Well, I hope you succeed. Ah, a trainer. We just stopped recording. Are you planning to take on the Pokemon League Challenge as well? I am. Just as I thought. Well, I hope you succeed. This is all for today's report. See you again next time. This Pokemon League, uh, this Pokemon Challenge seems interesting. I should look around uh, for the gym. And that's what we will do in the next episode. This is Sugar City, the city of shocks. Hello. This city is uh, famous for its uh, modern building designs, but uh, what matters is inside, right? Once I find a Pokemon Center, I will end off this episode. Oh, there's the gym. Sugar Gym. Leader Electric. Uh, no, sorry. Type electric. Leader Cherry. I work at the power plant underground, which uh, is also used as a gym. I'm sorry, but the gym leader is not currently at the gym. She could be back any time now, though. I sh I should check the Pokemon Center. Uh, I saw the professor in front of it. Uh, hello, Professor. Uh, let me go and talk to this guy first. Uh, this was uh, the 
latest city added to Cohen's map. However, this city is uh, has the first gym. Ironic, isn't it? Yeah. Ah, uh, bonjour, Joe. Since you are here, come in and I will show you the most important things. These uh, poke these buildings with the red roof are called uh, Pokemon Centers. You can heal your Pokemon at the counter by asking the very attractive nurse. She is really nice and gives trainers free health care every time they come into the Pokemon Center. For their Pokemon, of course, not for them. This is the Pokemon. In the certain regions, they have separate buildings for them. But here, it is inside of the Pokemon Centers. Anyway, you can buy all sorts of useful items here, from potions to Pokeballs. Be sure to check the mods uh, in every town, because certain mods have a different roster of items. Be sure you get enough Pokeballs and uh, potions. Sorry. Uh, but I need to pick this up. Um. Mm hmm. I uh, see. Okay, I will be there soon. I am sorry to interrupt this, uh, but one of my aides has called me back to the lab as fast as possible. Well, I will see you later. Good luck on your journey. Oh, I almost forgot. Your mum wanted me to give you this. A smartphone! Thanks, mum! Got myself a new iPhone! Got the new iPhone 12! Thanks, mum! Yeah, she said uh, this uh, will be useful in case of emergency. Uh, but I hope nothing bad will happen. Well, uh, good luck on your journey, Joe. Thanks, Professor. Anyway, this is where I'm going to choose to end off today's episode. Feel free to use the PC in the corner. The receptionist told me to do so. It was so kind of her. Pokemon centers have... Uh, heal your tired Pokemon. Uh, hurt or fainted Pokemon too. They make all Pokemon healthy. Cool. Anyway, this is where I'm going to choose to end off today's episode. If you enjoyed today's episode of Pokemon Scythe, then leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. We will be back every Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday with more episodes of this series. If you... But until next time, I am Lantern Joe. Go and check out all the information about Pokemon Scythe in the description below. Let me know what you think of this hack and... I'll see you next time. Till then, me to the Pokemon get to Laza. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And of course, you can ring the bell and you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me, Joe, and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you're a fan of this sort of thing, then you might like Power Zone Metal, a radio show presented by me and my brother Dan, aka the Gentleman of Metal. You can find out more information about that on powerzonemetal.uk. And of course, if you want to watch more videos, you can watch them by clicking in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. And of course, until next time, from me, Joe, and from the rest of the Lantern Nation, we'll see you again.